There are two types of class intervals when grouping numerical data, the inclusive type or the exclusive type of class intervals. In the inclusive type, both the upper and the lower limits are included in each class. So for example, if we construct a class interval of 1 to 9, 10 to 19, and so on, each class will include all the values in the data from the lower limit to the upper limit. And this is useful when the data is only in whole numbers, i.e. discrete data. But in the exclusive type of classification, the lower limit of each class is included, but the upper limit is excluded. So for example, if we construct a class interval of 1 to 10, 10 to 20, and so on, the first class will take values between 1 and 9.9, .9, but will exclude the value of 10, which is the upper limit. 10 will have to go into the next class. This type is particularly useful when dealing with continuous data because of the decimal points. Now, if you want to learn more about this topic and other important statistical concepts, check out my channel for more. And as always, thanks for watching.